Hi, welcome to my channel and today I have another theatre vlog for you. So tonight I'm off to the Lowry to their press night for Steel Magnolias. Now I've never seen this show before and I've never watched the film so I don't know anything about it. So I'm really excited to go and see it today at the Lowry. Uh, I'm sat in the stalls today on row O. I think I'm sat seat 18 and 19. I'm going with my mum today. So it should be really fun so I'm really looking forward to it. So I'm going to take you along. I don't think there'll be any merchandise but if there is I'll show you. Um, show you my view from my seat. Uh, if I can film the curtain call I'll film that and obviously I will uh, show you the programme and review the show at the end as well. So yeah, I hope you enjoy this little video. So I'm still waiting for my dad to pick me up and take me. They're very late. They're supposed to be here at 22. It's nearly 10 to now and they need to be there by 7 so yeah. I'll we'll see if we get there for seven, I'll have to see. Yeah, just wait for them to pick me up. I want to be daring, baby, dance the night away. I let my head down if I want. Don't you just get tired chasing fame and being pretty all the time? Doesn't sound like fun. You can do better. Let me show you what a good time looks like You can't do better so it's just seven o'clock now so we did actually arrive here more or less in time Larry's just here across the water so we're just gonna walk across the bridge just here and it's just across the bridge so I'm just gonna head across now. I don't fit to your box beauty queens with final blows you can do better I dare you to be wilder I don't fit into your box beauty queens with final flaws you can do better So we're just inside the Lowry now, just about to go and pick up a program from the press desk and then we're going to head in and find out. So we've just picked up our program from the press desk. We also got some wristbands for drinks and in interval as well, so just going to head in now. So we're in door H. So stay over here. Door H today. Okay, so we've got E tickets today, so we're just gonna head in now and show our ticket. Okay, so we're on row O, 18 and 19. So it's now 28 past seven, we're in our seats. We've got a really good view. Waiting for it to start now. Looking forward to it, Mom. Maybe you will find that there is more to like than being pretty Honey, let's just face it You can do better Let me show you what a good time looks like You can do better So much better mm -hmm. I don't fit So it is now the interval I'm really enjoying it so far I'm just going to head to the bar now Get a drink And I'll tell you more about it at the end of the show so just in the bar now, I've got a drink, I've got orange juice, mum's got some wine. Just reading the program. <laughs> what do you think of it, Mum? I enjoyed it, there's lots of funny bits. Yeah, it's good, isn't it? Yeah. So I'm now back from the theatre, so I thought I would tell you a bit about the show and give a little review of it. So Steel Magnolias was on at the Lowry Theatre in their Lyric Theatre, which is their biggest theatre. I was sat in the stalls on row O, C18 and 19. Um, the view for those seats was excellent, Def definitely recommend them seats. 
really had a really really good view the running time for this show was two hours and 30 minutes with a 20 minute interval uh, there wasn't any merchandise for this show other than the programs which i did get um i got this gifted as i was there for the press night um but i think to buy these these were five pounds and that was the only merch they had for the show so this play was written by robert harling uh who actually based uh the characters on people that he knew one of the characters was based on his sister and one of, on his mother and it is a character shelby which was based on his sister as his sister um was diagnosed with diabetes at the age of 12 um, like the character shelby the play when it first came out was a great success which led it to become a movie which starred a few famous people such as Dolly Parton, Julia Roberts, Sally Field so that is what a lot of people know the story from was from that movie I however have never seen the movie so I didn't know what the play was about I had no idea what the story was um, but I absolutely loved it it's a, such a good story it's all about friendship and helping others out and yeah I just really enjoyed this play so the play is set in Truvy's hair salon, which is in a small town in Louisiana. And this is where uh, a group of female friends meet every so often to get their hair done, where they can get away from all the men in their life. And they come here to gossip and obviously get their hair done. So the play starts um, on the day of Shelby's wedding. Shelby is the daughter of Emmeline who arrive at the hair salon to have their hair done for her wedding. Um, she, they're also joined in there by some of their friends who are also wedding guests. You have you have Claire Belcher and, and Louisa Bordreau. And then you also have Alyssa Dupuy who uh, has just been employed by Truvy that day to help out with doing the hair for the wedding. So I did think the first act was quite slow. It took me a while to get into it. Not too much happened in the first act. It's mostly talking about Shelby's wedding and you find out about her being diabetic. She then becomes ill due to her diabetes and her blood sugar's getting low. And so they give her a drink to try and get her blood sugar's back up to normal. You also find out in in that part that Shelby has been advised that she should not have children due to her diabetes. So the play then skips forward to Christmas time and you find out that Shelby is pregnant which her mum isn't too happy about because she's been told that it is dangerous for her to get pregnant with her diabetes so her mum is just a bit worried about her health with her being pregnant. Then the second act we find out that she has had the baby and that her health has taken a turn for the worst. So I don't want to give too much away about the plot but that is the basic story to it. Um, the actors in this were all amazing. Some of them gave some very powerful performances. I really thought the person playing Shelby's mother, Emlyn, gave an amazing performance and she was played by Laura Main. I also thought Diana Vickers playing Shelby was excellent. I thought she was really, really good. She had a really good accent and I really enjoyed her performance. The person playing Truvy also was excellent and Truvy was played by Lucy Speed. To be honest, the entire cast were excellent. I couldn't really fault any of them. So the set for the play I thought was really good. It was obviously set up like a hair salon. Um, I just really enjoyed the aesthetic. I thought it was really good set. They made good use of it. Uh, it didn't really change very much throughout the performance. It just had, they added an extra extra props to it. It changed direction at one point. Um, so you were seeing it from a different angle. Um, but yeah, it was, a, it was a good set and fit in well with the story. So I'll now just show you the programme uh, and go through the cast list. Okay, so this is the programme. It says on the front here that it's on at Lara from the 21st to the 25th of February. So if we have a look here, you've got a few adverts of 
some upcoming shows to Larry. Then you have a little article here. Um, Called Robert Harling and his steel magnolias just telling you a bit about Robert Harling and where his idea for the play came from you got this little bit about welcome to Louisiana some facts about Louisiana so it says here it's the largest city in New Orleans the state flower is the magnolia uh, it was the 18th state in the Union joined in 1812 and um, yeah just some other facts there about Louisiana and you've got this little the early 80s just a little timeline of things which happened during the early 80s then you've got a few production photos And then you have your cast list. So this cast list is in order of appearance. So you have Annelle Dupree, who is played by Elizabeth Ayadeli, Truvy Jones, played by Lucy Speed, Claire Belcher, played by Caroline Harker, Shelby Etterton, played by Diana Vickers, Emily Etterton, played by Laura Main, Weezer Boudreaux, played by Harriet Thorpe, Cover Emlyn, Weezer and Claire is Claire Carpenter, and then we have Cover Truvy, Shelby and Annelle, and that is Tabby Craig. And it just says here the story takes place in Truvy's beauty salon in Chinicopin, Louisiana, between 1983 and 1985. And that there is a 20 minute interval. You then have your creative team list and your production team. And then you have your cast biography so you can see um, who each person is. So this is Laura Main playing em Emlyn Etterton. Uh, Lucy Speed playing Truvy Jones, Harriet Thorpe is Weezer Boudreaux, Diana Vickers as Shelby Etterton, Elizabeth Ayadeli as Annel Dupree, Dupuy, and Caroline Harker as Claire Belcher. And these are the two understudies. Then you have Your creative team. Information about the producer. And then you have some more adverts for the Lowry. There's a little article here about the history of the program. And then just some more adverts. There you go, that is the program. So yeah, like I said, I really enjoyed this play. I thought it was really good, really funny, but also had a lot of heart in there as well. Uh, I would give this show four stars. Me and my mum really enjoyed it. Um, so yeah, uh, this show is on until the 25th of February at the Lowry. It is on a UK tour, uh, so it will be travelling to other venues as well. So I will link down below uh, a link to get tickets for all the Lowry performances. And I also will link Steel Magnolia's official website, which will list all the theatres it will be touring to as well. So I hope you have enjoyed this little theatre vlog. 
if you do enjoy theatre vlogs I'll be making lots more throughout the year um, so do subscribe and hit that notification bell if that is something you like to watch so by hitting the notification bell you'll be notified as soon as a new theatre vlog goes up I currently have Rocky Horror booked actually for tomorrow and Lion King booked for the next day so there's going to be two more uh, theatre vlogs coming up very soon and I also I'm also planning to book a few more next month as well so yeah I hope you have enjoyed this little theatre vlog if you have please do give it a like don't forget to subscribe and I hope to see you very soon bye <laughs>